Bonjour my friends, I'm Frankie and welcome to Club Foodie. When the weather is warm enough, guess what we like to do? Fire up the barbecue. Besides the usual suspects, which are burgers, hot dogs, steaks and so on, I like to grill a whole chicken. A few years ago, I posted my rotisserie chicken, which is fabulous. And now, here's another tasty one. In today's episode, I'll show you how to make my Caribbean jerk rotisserie chicken. This recipe is incredibly delicious. And trust me, tastier than the ones you buy at your supermarket. Loaded with flavor from the islands, this will certainly become a summer favorite. So my friends, let's hit cooking. In a small bowl, we'll add canola oil and some of my Jamaican jerk seasoning, which you can get the recipe by clicking on the top right corner of your screen. We'll whisk until nicely combined and set aside. After we've rinsed the chicken under cold water, removed any giblets, pat dry and truss the legs together as well as the wings, we'll insert the spit rod through the bird's cavity. We'll set the chicken over a large stainless steel bowl before sliding the other fork on the spit rod then insert firmly so the chicken stays in place when turning. Next, we'll brush on the rub, covering the entire bird with it. As you see, having the chicken over a bowl makes the task easier. Plus, there's no mess. Now, let's move on to the barbecue. When the temperature reaches 375 to 400 degrees Fahrenheit, We'll transfer the chicken to the barbecue, start the rotisserie motor, close the lid, and roast on indirect heat for 75 minutes to one and a half hours, or until the internal temperature reads 175 degrees Fahrenheit. Now, half an hour later, we'll take some of our Caribbean barbecue sauce and brush it on. Then we'll repeat this step every 15 minutes or until the chicken is done. By the way, this sauce is out of this world. And to get it, click on the link showing at the top right corner of your screen. And my friends, this is our Caribbean jerk rotisserie chicken. Moist and flavorful, this chicken is absolutely delicious. With only four ingredients, this easy recipe is perfect for summer. Served with potato salad, fries, or other side dish, it's a meal I'm sure you'll enjoy. I hope you give it a try soon, and be sure to visit clubfoodie.com for ingredient amounts, directions, and more info. Until next time, my friends, bon appétit.